Hi guys, it's me, Red. Today I will be doing a Christmas hairstyle kind of themed video. I'll be showing you how to get holiday curls, so kind of like for the holiday season to get nice curly hair. I don't know if you know this, but Nick, this is Nikki, this is Nikki. Um, she's had a trim. Her hair's been trimmed, so it's really nice. I've put layers. I've given her some highlights in her roots. So she's bit. She's had a bit of a hair makeover. But I'm going to show you how to get heatless curls in my hair. Um, there are a lot of tutorials on how to use heat on your dolls hair. But to be fair, I don't really recommend it because it can ruin the plastic. It can fry the hair. So that's why I don't recommend using heat. But I'm going to show you how to get to keep those curls. So this is what you're going to need. So the first thing you're going to need is a cup of cold water, a set of bobby pins, a hairbrush. I prefer the paddle ones because it covers more room and a reliable comb. And before anybody asks and put in the comments or before I get judged, it's not going to be pin curls, okay? Because, guys, I can't do pin curls to save my life. It's not going to be pin curls, but we're doing Bantu knots. I don't know if anyone's heard of them, but um, they work on human hair perfectly fine, so I don't know how they're going to work on doll hair. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to split the hair. You don't have to use a hair bobble for this, but I would prefer it. You can put it over one side, some people prefer to do that. But I'm actually going to use a hair bobble. So I'm just going to split the hair. This is Nikki's hair is much shorter now, it doesn't really um, work. But we're just going to turn the camera here a little. And I'm just going to comb all the baby hairs over. This is when we're going to need a cup of water. I don't use a spray bottle. I just like to use a cup of water. Wet my hands and put it all the way through. So I feel like when I'm using a spray bottle, I always use too much water. Depending on how much water comes out of the spray bottle. So I know if I put some in my hands, it just, it works better. So I'm going to show you how to do the knot, the Bantu knot. Okay, so we're going to start off with this section of hair. Okay, and I we'll want it a little thick because we don't want the sections too thin. We want nice, voluminous, I love that word, voluminous curls. So we're going to just spin it in our hands. So you just want to twirl. Just like so. And then you're going to want to twirl it on top of each other and then just pull it through like a knot like this and then you see where that and and i can't speak today i'm just opening my bobby pins and where that end is we're gonna put a bobby pin this is really coming out of focus there we go and then you just go and want to secure that So now we're going to do it for the rest of the hair. So I've done both sides of her hair. It's looking very cute. Imagine going to school like that. <laughs> In fact, it didn't look that bad, depending. But um, what was I gonna say? Yeah. Um, so we've finished doing that. I'm gonna leave this for about an hour. 
So I left it a little bit over an hour, but that's okay. It's probably better. So I'm going to start from where I started because that's going to be the curl that was longer. So let's get to doing this. this works actually really well they are so nice and light and fuzzy they are so nice and just imagine all the stars you could do and i bet if you left this in it overnight they'll be really tight but i wanted some nice loose curls or waves so i'm going to go and take some pictures now so um yeah basically thank you so much for watching and i really hope you enjoyed this video i think i'll do a video on wednesday hopefully so come back then and that's it for now bye guys bye red and nikki fleming out mm -hmm.